Fucking. Oh, okay. And so let's see. If I'm not if I'm not mistaken, okay, Roy will, will be able to smother uh, okay, the the other uh, Diddy Kong okay, for the attacks. Yeah, no, Roy definitely being a a mashier character than Diddy Kong. Roy is going to be wanting to get up in Diddy Kong's face and really make sure that Infernape is not able to set up any sort of resources like, um, you know, like Banana. But mm -hmm. now that Link J-Man is in the corner, Infernape is going to be able to find that chance. Ooh, I think Link J-Man tried to, that down air attempt was to pick up the Banana, but just didn't quite work out. Maybe some... Oh, that would have been the stock. Maybe some matchup unfamiliarity. Uh, again, right there, actually. You know, side being on top of the banana definitely would have been the stock. But, you know, banana coming in clutch to save Infernape's life. Oh, and uh, let's see. So so far, yeah, uh, Link J-Man is, is having a little bit of struggle of, of keeping the clock, of keeping control of this monkey. Oh, Ooh, and... There we go. As, as soon as the momentum became Infernape, Link J-Man basically went from like 60 to death. So that's kind of been... So far we've seen that Link J-Man's um, offense is very good, but it's, you know, once it stops being their turn, that's when, you know, things have started to fall apart. Right now looking for up throw kills, but even at 180 with no rage, you're not killing just yet. Maybe Let a 190? There you go. Finally, third time's a charm. Mm -hmm. And and just like that, every, everything is, is, is set back to neutral. So let's so let's see if, uh, if Link J-Man could, could take the, the lead over here. All right, trying to get a little cute there with a, bana a potential banana into down air, but, you know, experimenting on the fly, not quite finding that one. So just kind of going back to good old reliable with uh, some great pressure right now. Mm-hmm. The... Link J Man does seem to be a little unfamiliar with the match. I'm seeing a lot, a lot of moves of his with him out of nowhere, and and that uh, Diddy Kong himself is a fairly light character, so it's a little hard to probably Ooh. juggle him. But killing him, oh, it'll be it'll be essential with Roy if he managed to sweet, uh, hit him with a sweet spot. Yeah, all it takes. Okay. Oh, good. good wait. Good, yeah, great patience by Link J Man. You know, knowing that that was a terrifying <coughs> situation for Infernape. Dash attack across the stage. Going to be setting Infernape up for that back air. And Link J Man now sitting in a pretty comfortable lead, only 53% on their second stock. I am already liking okay, the adaptation with, with Link J Man. He noticed okay, that, that his usual play hasn't been working. So so now he's, he sort of slowed it down slightly and, and hopes okay, to play more accurately with his hits. Ooh, what a read on the air dodge right there, uh, baiting it out with the empty jump. All right, trying to use the banana peel to cover their recovery. Now getting sent back off stage. Going to see if Infernape can start setting up some edge guard or some ledge trapping situations. Ooh. I don't know who that down air was hitting, but. Hmm. Oh, man. Ooh, a little bit slow on the reaction oh, to good. get the F good. smash. Good reaction okay, by by a front end, okay, recognizing okay, that the Link J Man okay, uh, okay, managed to trip up and die. Ooh. Link J Man just came in and did it. Recognized that Infernape was on the ledge, and <laughs> they they don't even know like like they or they don't even look like they knew what they did. It's it's the battle of, of the apes over it's here. The... Who, which which one could, can, can mash the hardest? Hmm. Don't worry about. It. Oh. <laughs> uh, but but yeah. So I'm so I'm liking the uh, the adaptation with, with Link Jamet. If if he could just hold his buttons a little bit whenever he's like you know not in disadvantage, he should uh, he should be able to win matches a little more cleanly. Whoop. Roy goes so far when he side beat on a banana. Right. <laughs> All right. Uh, and Frenape running things right back into PS2, trying to be the change that you want to see in the world. Salty run back, let's go. And definitely PS2, uh, one of the better stages for Diddy Kong. Um, <coughs> you know, the, the two platform layout, giving Diddy Kong a lot of room to uh, circle camp and, you know, make sure that Banana is always online. So. 
Luffy and already cool. working out pretty good for him. One, one twelve on Link J Man. I, I do like how, how Infern uh, Infern uh, Nape is, is being uh, a pretty a little more evasive against uh, against Roy's uh, attacks, n knowing uh, that that there are times where he sort of swing for the fences. Oh. Missed. And I do also want to point out that little interaction that just happened uh, with Infernape. Um, Infernape got hit by a move and then uh, down tilted afterwards to kind of try and check Link J Man's aggression, which we've definitely seen through game one. You know, Link J Man, uh, just from game one, seems to be a very press forward type of player. Press, press forward to win. Hey, s simple, okay. s simple as that. Ooh, un unfortunate with, with, with the conversion. Okay, I managed Ooh. to get the, okay, the, the down air spike, but, but could not land a hit afterwards. Let's see it, right now. All it, right, trying to use the side B to uh, catch Infernape's approach, but only getting the one hit, and Infernape the, just will not stop stepping on the gas right now. Getting Link J Man now to 100 on their second stock. Ooh. Oh no. The, the overcommitment by the. Okay. By the back here, okay. Actually, made him okay. SD, unfortunate. Let's see. Right, right now though, okay. Uh, Infernape is 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 is, uh, is really far in the lead. He doesn't have to approach, okay, technically, but uh, it's uh, it's his game on how how he wants how he wants to deal with it. Yeah, and I think right now Infernape really is trying to play a very bait and punish game style, you know, really trying to just get Link J Man to swing first. And it's paying out dividends right now. Almost getting the Z drop dare, but a jab forward air finally gonna be putting Link J Man on the board in this game too, but I don't I don't really know how long it's gonna last. Ooh. If, if Link J Man could, 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 could get some could good reads and he he could he could bring this back, but that that is a big a, a pretty big hill to climb. Let's, let's see if Infernape is, is going to edge guard. No? Okay. Great patience by Link J Man, actually. Uh, not falling for the up smash out of shield. Jumping out of the corner is such a tempting option, but uh, getting the monkey flip grab is absolutely going to be doing it at the corner. Infernape bringing us to 1 1. All right, so let's see. So so we saw Battlefield and, and Town versus City uh, uh, marked off. So where are they going to go? Hmm, let's see. You could you could bring uh you, you could bring him okay, to uh, Smashville, but I can match that being very very chaotic between these two uh players. Uh he could also go to uh no wait, no. Um, oh no, Town City is has been banned. So the other stages he could he go to is possibly Kalos. It does look like uh Smashville is going to be Link J Man's counter pick of choice. So uh, probably going to be looking, like you were saying, uh, for, for some more scramble situations. This, now this could, now this could, okay, okay, give, uh, give, wait. What are we doing, Link J-Man? Took their cursor off of Roy. Okay, oh, okay. <laughs> All right. So, so that's what I was saying. This, this could work out, okay, in, in Diddy Kong's, okay, favor if, if you manage to, to be more patient, because otherwise, uh, Roy's uh, okay, um, smashes okay, and, and airs are like really lethal okay, on, on both the middle part of the stage okay, and off stage. All right, great side B to catch the monkey flip coming in. Let's see. Like J-Man uh, kind of just giving up stage, uh, stage positioning, not really you know, wanting to deal with the banana very much. And now just trying to make that center platform, you know, their home. You know, we, we've said before, the, the center platform on uh, Smashville or Hollow Bastion, such a, like, comforting <laughs> space to be in. Like, it really uh, covers a lot of angles for approach. So if Link J-Man really wants to plant their feet in center stage, then, you know, they're going to be sitting pretty. And I'm seeing a, a lot of whiffs from, 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 from these two, but... Right, right, right now, um, Link J Man ooh. is is, ooh, he is getting hit. Yeah, drop the shield just a little bit too early there on the up smash, and potentially dropping what could have been a stock punish. That oh. time, all right. No, 
no strong punish there. Un unfortunate. Yeah, I'd Link J-Man was looking for potentially a tech chase scenario, but called out too hard that uh, Infernape wouldn't tech uh, outward and didn't quite work out for it. That oh. time, though, the side B, even from center stage, going to be doing it with that much rage. And Link J-Man now in even stocks with Infernape. Hey, even. Let's go. <laughs> So I'm I'm liking the, the, the control in space of a, with it with it as, as far as the as far as his flips and, and, and banana. He's really making sure he doesn't get hit too often and, and if he does uh okay, Link J Man will have to will have to like commit to it. I really like the way that Link J Man has been using Blazer so far in this set, you know, has the, the armor on startup, really making use of it, especially in these scramble situations. Yeah, yeah, same. Oh, nice, right. nice kick there. All right, Infernape, uh, you know, moving backward, trying to maybe start playing that uh, frustration game, but instead, right there, getting a solid whiff on it. Oh, and a great uh, edge guard as well, getting that Z drop dare finally. Now, Link J Man potentially on their winner's stock. Oh, no. Baiting out the Blazer real hard. That's so much damage. That's like 30 damage for getting hit by a banana peel. Oh man. Uh, and and Link J Man is, is like like swinging for the fences. Maybe a little flustered by, 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 by that accumulated damage that he got. Linfernape had the idea by waiting for the neutral air dodge, but unfortunately just wasn't able to get anything out of it. Blazer, that has to be stale by now. Oh, all right, oh, but, but not that back here. Yeah, great ledge <laughs> trump by Link J Man. Now bringing us to even stocks, and now with Roy at the ledge with a little bit of rage, this could be scary for Infernape, and the percents keep climbing. But this, but this could also uh, also be Link J Man's uh, uh, game if, if he managed to get some reads in. Cool. Nape had the idea, but just barely didn't have the spacing for the monkey flip. Ooh. Well, let's see. An edge guard could, could, could end his life. Ooh. And yeah, absolutely, a banana F smash will be will be taking it. So even so, even though I, I mentioned how, how how it was going to be chaotic, it was not as chaotic as as, as I thought. It seemed both of them sort of respected uh, the the space and and, and potential uh, disadvantage of course that they would be in if they were to ask, if they would actually whiff. But uh, let's see. But yeah, that uh that back year there of course, by by Lane J man of course, of course, I was pretty good. And yeah, you can even see Infernape like really took his time. Like, all right, I got the banana. I've hit confirmed. Are we good? Are we good? All right, yeah, we're good. F smash time. I've won. Clean F smash right there. Play, play to his advantage. Yo, Link J Man's fit is kind of clean. Not gonna lie. Yeah. <laughs>